Hello and welcome back to Boo Polo Channel. My name is Pascal. Today I am going to do a review of this Vitron uh, Smart Solar Charger. Uh, it's an MPPT uh, charger that I use in my boat. I also use it here with an inverter for running a crypto miner, but that's, we're not going to do that today. I have it set up at the moment. I have it set up uh, to, uh, to run the, the, the motor over here. I will show you it in a moment and I will show you the app. But the first thing we're going to do is we are going to, uh, we're going to download the app. If you like this video or any of our other videos, please subscribe. We click on the smart solar charger rather than the battery uh, protect. Uh, and we can see uh, at the moment that we're only using one watt. Now, as you can see now, you can see the solar charging, it, which we couldn't do before because the battery was full. Uh, so I run the battery out a little bit. So I'm going to, uh, I'm going to turn on this now and you will see the So it's on the state of bulk. It was, it, was, it was just taking over the charging there earlier. And now I have this one on, I have this on, on, uh, on the full amount now. So uh, the current, the current coming in is 3.5. So uh, this will maintain it. It's, it's 216 watts, so it, it should be fine. Uh, it, the charging, it's, it's, gone, it's gone on to bulk instead of trickle charge. So. Uh, uh, the power, we don't have it because we're not using the output of it. You, I put a link down in the description where I purchased this. I purchased it on Amazon. We can go on to uh, the battery protect. It does not give you very much information there. It will just tell you the battery. The battery, when it starts getting, when it gets very low, uh, the battery protect will cut it out. So, yes. This is the setup I have in the boat. I actually go for five and a half hours in this at a slow pace. And I'm just after plugging it back in again now. Now it's starting to bulk charge again, as you can see on the screen. So when I unplug the solar, uh, it's not charging them anymore. But uh, if I leave it like this for a while, it will it will it will go back to float charge. So that's my review of the smart solar charger by Vitron. Uh, this is the 20 amp. Uh, if you don't want to buy, if you wanted to buy the, the, the bigger one of these, that's 40 amp, you, you, you don't need the battery uh, protect. Uh, you probably don't need it. It will protect the battery. This will protect the battery uh, on loads under 20 amp. And as you see here, we are at 228 uh, watts charging. So, and it's only slightly sunny outside. So on the, in the boat, I can go for hours and hours on the boat with the trolling motor on it and uh, with our family. And now it's going to go back to float. As you see, it's gone back to float, fully charged. So that's my review of the MPPT uh, charger the, the, by Bitron. It's a smart solar charger and uh, 12, uh, it works at 12 or 24 uh, volts, so you I can I connect it up uh, in parallel, which I done before. I had it at 24, but for the for for this motor is 12. Uh, um, this trolling motor is 12 volts, so I, I put a link down in the description where I purchased this. I purchased it on Amazon. Thank you very very much for watching, and if you like this video or any of our other videos, please subscribe. So we're after going up the coast there. Uh, we've gone up about maybe four kilometers, uh, five kilometers, and uh, uh, no, it went no problem. It took us about 45 minutes. So 